Now, just one more question on that document, um, and this goes to the, the more salacious rumors, but I would like you to just, whatever you can say on it. Obviously, our current president has had relationships with Epstein in the past, and there are those, uh, Katie Johnson and maybe other victims who have accused Trump of being involved in things like this. Um, in my experience, Trump supporters will not listen to anything along those lines. Obviously, we're not a court of law here right now, but are those claims of those, though that case was dropped, it was dropped before it went to, to court, in your opinion as a lawyer and your experience, is there anything you can say as to the validity of those claims or whether or not there will be any, you know, any more about that? Nothing at all. I, the only thing that I can say about President Trump is that he is the only person who in 2009, when I served a lot of subpoenas on a lot of people, or at least gave notice to some pretty uh, connected people that I was going, that I wanted to talk to them. He is the only person who picked up the phone and said, let's just talk. I'll give you as much time as you want. I'll tell you what you need to know. And was very helpful in the information that he gave and gave no indication whatsoever that he was involved in anything untoward whatsoever, but had good information that checked out and that helped us sure. and that we didn't have to take a, a, a deposition of him. And that was in 2009? That was in 2009. So, do you know if there's any truth to James Patterson's claims that Trump kicked Epstein out of Mar-a-Lago? I've definitely heard that. Yeah. I, I definitely heard that. And I don't know that it was Trump himself, as opposed to a manager there. <laughs> but uh, it's Trump's club, so yeah, people credit him. Trump. I, I've heard the rumor that Epstein was kicked out of there for allegedly trying to pick up somebody's daughter or something like that. But I think I did chase that down sure. as far as I could and, and never was able to confirm it, but I, I heard I'm, it. I'm on the same same boat with that. Um, and just as far as Mar-a-Lago, that's where Virginia Roberts was kind of brought into the whole scheme, right? Through, via, uh, that's Maxwell. where she was recruited. Yeah, absolutely. So. That's where she was recruited and brought to Jeffrey Epstein's house. So, you know, the story of someone else being recruited there is, is not so far-fetched. Absolutely. It's believable.